hi guys and welcome back to my channel so today I'll be doing a vacation clothing and accessory haul um, some of my favorite things to do pre vacationing is shop I mean I shop a lot like I just shop and shop and shop anywho so today I wanted to share with you guys some of the clothing pieces accessory pieces purses I guess those are accessories too um, that I've bought for my vacations coming up this summer and yeah so let's get started all right, so first I'm going to start off with the clothes, then I'll move on to like jewelry and shoes and bags. And yeah, so I'm going to, in clothes, I'm going to tell you guys the size I bought and how much that item was just so you guys have a better idea. And also I will be linking all the clothing items, all the accessories, everything in the description below. Some items may be sold out, maybe, 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 and some may be on sale, so you guys will get lucky. I'll tell you what I got on sale versus what I got on regular price, and so on and so forth. So we'll get started now. Alright, so this first piece, I bought these pants. Aren't they so cute? Um, these are an extra small petite, and they're still a bit loose on the waist for me, so I would have rather gotten an extra, extra small petite. But um, an extra small petite works. Uh, I got these for, crap, these don't have sizes on them. I mean, prices on them. Crap. Um, I think I got these for about 70 bucks, but yes, I will be listing them in the description below. I'll kind of give you guys an approximate price. But yeah, these are one of the pants I got for like beachy vacations. <laughs> Alright, next I got this plain white shirt. This is what the back looks like. This is what the front looks like. I also got this from The Loft. This was $24.50 USD. Some prices are in USD, some are in Canadian because some stuff I ordered from the US and got it shipped to the US, some stuff I ordered in Canada. So yeah, but anyways, this is just a plain white shirt. I love it. It goes with white jeans, you know, those pants that I just showed you. I could just tuck it in and wear it. And this is like really light and soft. So yeah, it was a really good piece to buy. This dress I also got from The Loft. I love The Loft. So this is what the dress looks like. It has like a little tying thing here. Um, it's a sleeveless dress. It comes up like a few inches above my ankles for me. In the picture, it did show that it came up to the girl's knees, but obviously I'm five foot tall, so this also doesn't have the price, but it's a small, I believe this was also like $70, $80 US. But yeah, it's a really nice dress, and the quality of loft clothing is like literally the best. I love the, I love how soft it is, and they're super long lasting. So yeah, this is a dress I also bought like for like beachy, summery vacations. White jeans are a summer staple, and I got mine from the loft. Ooh, shocker! But yeah, I got these white jeans. They're just any normal white jeans. I got them in a size 26, but I got curvy skinny just because, I don't know, I feel like I'm a little curvy. But um, yeah, I just got them in curvy skinny, but they fit really well. Uh, I could have sized down a size, but these work. I like, I like how they feel. I don't like super fitted jeans, especially when I'm on vacation. But yeah, white jeans are just a good summer staple to have. And I could like literally wear them with that white plain shirt and just some nice colorful earrings. And yeah, that would be a great outfit. Okay, so this is literally my favorite shirt ever. Obviously still from the loft. Um, look how beautiful it is. Like just look at the colors. Like I love how colorful it is. Um, I got this for $44.50 US. Um, it's a in a size small. This could have, I could have actually bought an extra small and it would still fit fine. But I love the looser look it has and like the armpit side, like, you know, the sleeves are kind of tighter. Like the armpit side is a little tighter. It's a little more snug. I mean, it's fine on me. But yeah, so I did like the looser size a lot better. And this is just such a beautiful, comfortable, and like the quality, man. The quality is just so perfect. But yeah, this is one of my favorite shirts ever. I'm super excited to wear it. I love rompers, jumpsuits, whatever. Um, there's different ways to say it. But yeah, I love rompers slash jump food, jump foods. No, not jump foods, jumpsuits. And um, especially, especially, especially for summer vacations. And I got this one from The Loft. It's super nice. Oh my gosh, like, look at the back frill it has going on. And it's just, it's such a beautiful jumpsuit. Like, I mean, just look at the colors and everything. I love the colors at The Loft. Um, this I got in a size 2P, so too petite. Um, it's $89.50 US and the only reason I'm saying US and Canadian is because some of my items um, going forward are Canadian so I want to kind of make sure I say the right price but yes um, I got this for $89.50 US um, the 2P I could have sized down in that too but for jumpsuits when I'm on vacation I like a looser fit so that's why I chose 2P I could have gone to 0P and the only reason I'm telling you guys this oh my god she keeps telling us her sizes but no I'm telling you guys this just so you can get a better idea if you want to buy some of these pieces on what size to pick because the loft is a little tricky with their sizes I mean they have like a small then the extra small then extra extra small and then sometimes they have an extra 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 small I believe so yeah you just have to be careful with that so yeah that's why I'm giving you guys my sizes but yeah this is this is a really nice piece 
As much as I love cute, comfy, flowery clothes on vacation, sometimes I just like to put on sweats and a t-shirt, especially at airports. So these are more my airport clothes. So let's get, let me show you guys. All right. So this is a Nike shirt I got. Um, literally, it's just a plain Nike t-shirt. I got it in the size small. It's very loose on me, but I wanted a loose shirt because I like to wear loose clothing at the airport. Um, it was retail price, $30. I'm Canadian. I got it on sale for $19.99, so that was really nice. It's just a plain Nike shirt in black that says, just do it. I wasn't too creative. This one's in a blue. It also says, just do it. Um, $19.99, I got it on sale. It was originally $30. And this one, says Nike, wow, very nice. It's in a small, all of these are very loose on me, but I like looser clothing on airports, like I said. But yeah, these are just plain t-shirts for airports or just a lazy day. This is also another one of those plain t-shirts I got. I love plain t-shirts, they're just, I love them. I just love rocking them with like hair and pants or just tights or sweats or whatever. So this is another plain t-shirt I got from Victoria's Secret. They were having a semi-annual sale. Um, so this is originally $24.95 US. I got it for $9.99. So that was really nice. Um, it's just a plain t-shirt. It's just a gray t-shirt. Super nice and comfy. So yeah, it's great for vacations. So I'm not really a jewelry person on vacation here and there I'll put on some earrings. Um, I take more of a comfortable approach, but I did go and buy these two tassel earrings. They're not from Bobble Bar. I do have Bobble Bar ones, but these are from Ava and Aiden. I got them from Saks. They're $26 Canadian each and they're just really beautiful. And like I said, on those like white pants and white shirt, I could like wear these earrings or wear these earrings or whatever on other outfits. So I just really like them. They're super cute. They're super tassely, but they're like made of fur. If that makes any sense. Like I know um, Bobble Bahar has those like really heavy beaded ones that I have and they just kind of weigh my ears down. But I like these ones because they're not too heavy. And yeah, they're super cute. Obviously, there's no summer vacation without a new pair of sunglasses. So I bought these from Key Australia. They were $50 US. Um, I really like them. I really like Key Australia sunglasses. Shaw calls them my bug sunglasses because all my Key Australia sunglasses are too big for my face. So he's like, you look like a bug. Do I look like a bug, guys? I think I'm slaying pretty hard if you ask me. But anyways, um, I love these sunglasses. They're super comfortable. And yeah, they're just really nice. Especially because I have a really big head. My favorite place to buy hats is Nordstrom. And I just bought another pair. I don't know if you guys have seen my pictures, but I bought that black hat from Nordstrom too. And over time, I have bought a few hats from Nordstrom. But anywho, anywho I got this one for, it was originally $29. I got it for $14.49 Canadian um, at the Nordstrom sale. And it's just a super cute hat. Like I could rock it with like my white pants. I probably look like a loser right now. Like, Anyways, I'm done. But yeah, this is a super cute hat. Um, I have a black one like this that I bought for $55 and it wasn't on sale. There was no sale going on at that time. But yeah, this one is by, hmm, who is it by? Okay, I give up. I don't know who it's by. But anywho, I got this hat. It's super cute. I love it. On to the next one. I'm not really a big fan of wearing heels when I'm on vacation just because like, I'm usually wearing the same outfit, same shoes all day before I go back to the hotel because I just like to do everything. But yeah, so but I did got buy these Mark Fisher wedges. Um, I've heard such great things about them, so I'm really excited to try them out on vacation. Um, how much were these? I believe these were around $200, give or take. But yes, I will link them. You know what? I'm gonna try to open these single-handedly. They're so cute. I made that work pretty well if you ask me but yeah look how cute these are and honestly these are like so light like you'd expect them to be like bulky and heavy but they're not and they're super cute and I'm super excited to wear, wear them no I'm super excited to wear them and they're super cute so yeah these are one of the only heels I'll be taking on vacation and they're not even heels or wedges also all my shoes are six and a half it just honestly depends. Sometimes I wear a six and a half, sometimes a six, sometimes I even go down to a 5.5. So it just depends on the brand. For those Mark Fisher shoes, I'm a six and a half. And these Steve Madden shoes, I'm also a six and a half in. And look how cute these are. They're like perfect and they're so comfortable. Like, I wish I could like have you guys like feel it. Like I wish you could like feel it through YouTube. But yeah, these are so comfortable and they're so cute. And I'm super excited to like wear them on vacation. They're like the perfect vacation shoe. These shoes I actually got in a 7, which was weird because I rarely ever wear a 7. But yeah, this is what they look like. They're just a normal strap-on kind of shoes. Nothing 
fancy. I just love how comfortable they are because I love Steve Madden shoes. They're just really comfortable. Steve Madden, Tory Burch, they just make really comfortable flats and sandals and stuff. But yeah, these are just a normal staple I guess you need when you're wearing like, especially when I'm wearing the jumpsuits or just the dresses. They're just a nice pair of shoes to wear when your toes are done. Which reminds me, I need to get a pedicure. But yeah, that's what they look like. It was that time of the year to buy a new crossbody. So I went ahead and bought another Gucci crossbody. Actually, I didn't buy it. My husband bought it for me. He's like looking at me from behind the camera. He bought it for me for being a really good wife. But yeah, he's super sweet. Um, and I did cheat and I took this to Houston. Um, and I did wear this in Houston for my brother's graduation. So I, so I cheated because this was supposed to be for my summer vacations. But anywho, um, for those of you who haven't seen it, I didn't actually post any pictures in it. This is what it looks like. It's like super cute. It's like the disco bag, but a little bigger. Oh, if I could just get it look how beautiful this is that's what it looks like it's just a beautiful Gucci crossbody um, it can fit a lot of stuff in here just like I said about the disco before and yeah it's just a must-have well not a must-have a nice to have also that Gucci bag was um, 1600 Canadian yes 1600 Canadian I believe it's like 1300 US or something along those lines anywho um, when I like to go on summer vacations, I do like to take a big bag with me, especially when we go out to the beach. I just like to stuff my beach towel in there, my sunscreen. So I do like to take a big bag with me. So I bought this MCM bag. Um, I just love MCM. And it's just super beachy and cute. And it comes with like a little wristlet pouch thing so I could put like my passports and stuff in there. And it's just like a super cute bag and it's super flowery and super beachy. I'm really excited to actually start wearing it. I love like the stud detail right here. But yeah, it smells so good. But anywho, I love new bags. But yeah, this is the MCM bag I bought. Also, that MCM bag was a thousand Canadian or like 1100 Canadian, something along those lines. Like I said, I will link it in the description below. Anywho, guys, these are my vacation haul items so far. Obviously, I'll keep shopping and keep shopping. We do have a few vacations planned this summer. Um, we've already been to Houston, but we've got a few more coming up. That was more of like a family visit. So we're super excited about it. But yeah, these are some of the items I've bought. I do have more and more to shop for. But yeah, I think that's all I have to say. Yeah, one more thing. Um, I haven't started shopping for Shaw yet. He told me to wait a little bit, but I am gonna obviously go and buy a lot of different vacation pieces for him. So let me know if you guys would like to see that video. Like. Vacation haul for Shaw, vacation haul for my husband. I don't know, maybe I could do a video like that. Maybe I will. Anywho, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.